Hey guys, I'm so glad that we are able to still have our leap class. I know this is a pretty silly way of doing it, but at least you guys get to enjoy a story time and some songs. I'm going to show you guys an art project. And I want you to know that Miss Wesley and Miss Rochelle say hello and they miss you. Some of you guys know me. I'm Miss Sarah for those of you that do not. So, you guys know the song we sing at the start of every leap class, but I bet that your mommies and daddies do not. So, I need you guys to show them how it goes. I'm going to sing it, but you guys have to act it out, okay? Are you ready? Here we go. Hands go up and hands go down. I can turn myself around. I can stand up on one shoe. I can listen, so can you. I can sit, I'll show you how. Story time is starting now. All right, good job, guys. Today we are reading Planting a Rainbow, and it is all about flowers. So I have my little flower pot and some flowers that we're going to stick in it as we read the book. Here we go. Every year, Mom and I plant a rainbow. In the fall, we buy some bulbs and plant them in the ground. These are bulbs. They're like big seeds. We order seeds from a catalog and wait all winter long for spring to warm the soil and sprout the bulbs. Look, they're starting to come out of the ground. Then it's time to go to the garden store and select some seedlings. So they have their bulbs planted and now they have filled up their wagon with some more little plants. We sow the seeds and set out the plants in the soil. All right, they're starting to plant everything. And watch the rainbow grow. All those pretty plants coming up. And grow. And grow, which is your favorite color. I like these blue ones. We have some red flowers. Let's put our red flower in. And orange flowers. Orange flowers. And some yellow blooms. We grow something green. Look, I even have a green flower. And some blue flowers. And some purple flowers too. All summer long, we pick them and bring them home. Look how pretty that bouquet is. And when summer is over, we know we can grow our rainbow again next year. The 
end. All right, let's sing a song. Okay, here we go. You guys can do this with me, okay? Seeds are buried deep, deep, deep in the soil. They sleep, sleep, sleep. Yellow sun is bright, bright, bright. Raindrops falling light, light, light. Gentle breezes blow, blow, blow. See little seeds grow, grow. All right, guys, and on the paper that I dropped off at your house, there's another song called Five Pretty Flowers, and you guys can sing that with your mommy or your daddy, and you can go outside and you can pick some flowers to sing with the song, or you can draw your own papers, flowers, out of construction paper and sing it that way. Okay, so now I'm going to show you guys the art project for today. Okay, for today's flower art project, you should have a big piece of white paper and a flower cookie cutter. And so the only things you need are some paper plates with paint on them. I chose blue, red, and yellow because with those three colors, I can also make orange, purple, and green. All right, so all I'm gonna do is I think I'm gonna start Remember I said blue is my favorite flower? So I'm going to start with some blue flowers. Let's see, how about I make three? One, two, three. I'm going to make some red flowers, and this may actually make purple, because red and blue make purple. Let's do three of these, too. One, two, three. All right, now let's make some yellow flowers. One. Ooh, look at that. Some orange and some green in there for mixing those colors. Two. Right. Now, if I wanted, I could keep going and just totally cover the whole page, or I could stop. And maybe I want to add the center of the flowers to these, which a lot of times I feel like is green. So I'm going to take a little bit of blue, a little bit of yellow, and just with my finger, I'm doing it right in the middle. You don't have to do this, but you can if you want to. All right, guys. So now you can make some beautiful flower art with your paper and your cookie cutter. I can't wait to see what you guys come up with. All right, my friends. Now it is time for the goodbye song. So I want you guys to all stand up and show your mommy and daddy that you know how to do this one, too. Here we go. Touch the stars. Touch your toes, turn around and touch your nose, wave down low and wave up high. Now it's time to say goodbye. Thanks for watching this video and next week we will send you another story that is all about Bye.